Alright, ready? You ready? Mm -hmm. Hey, this is Scotch Test Dummies coming to you on America's Whiskey Wednesday. Just a reminder, America's Whiskey Wednesday, we cover whiskeys from the United States and from Canada. And if we ever find some from Mexico, they're included because they're from North America. But we haven't found the whiskey from Mexico Not yet. Not yet. I heard there used to be one. We're also the Whiskey Tasting Fellows. He was waiting for me to say that. Yes, I was. Now, I'm going to you, give you a little backstory. Wiggle. I was in Pittsburgh on... Pittsburgh, Kansas? No. Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. No. Peaburg, Steel Town, the Steelers. I was there for, let's say, a business trip. It was pretty much a business trip. And two things happened. One... I got to meet Whiskey Raj and went to Acacia A Whiskey Bar and I got to try Was it fabulous? It was wonderful. And somebody told me you got to go check out Wiggle. Wiggle's a craft distiller. Um, I'd seen they only did tours on Saturday. I was not there on a Saturday, but I grabbed a couple guys that were with me from the company and said, uh, you got to come with me. Um, I want to go to this place. Uh, we showed up. And I went in and I said I wanted to try some stuff. I did mention that I was from the Scotch Test Dummies and Wes came out. Wes was very pleasant. Um, I think he looked us up online just to make sure we were legit. Mm. And uh, We he, are too legit to quit. We're too legit to quit. And what I got with my buddies that were with me was a, a little impromptu tour of their little craft distiller. Now, a couple cool things. They recently bought a barrel house that's actually across the river, and they're going to be doing all kinds of extended barrel caskings. I had just missed, um, I was like six to eight weeks away from the release of their straight bourbon, their two-year aged bourbon. Now, later on, we'll be doing a deal with their with a, another bourbon that they had, but it's not a straight bourbon. And I picked up this organic rye whiskey. While I was there, he gave me a lovely deal on, I had to ask, hey, it's Wiggle, you got a noose in here, what's the deal? I was aware of the risk whiskey rebellion after the Revolutionary War, I'm a big history nut, and he included the history that Wiggle, or he was German, so it was probably Weigel, um, Uh, they hung him? They were going to hang him. Oh. Him and another guy, well, he beat up. He I'm beat up the yet. tax guy. Yeah, I'll he beat him up. into the chase there. George Washington actually pardoned him. If you get a chance um, and you're in Pittsburgh, stop by Wiggle, see if Wes is there. There was another great gal, I can't remember her name, that greeted me when I came in. And uh, you can try flights of whiskey. Karen um, I believe it was Catman Jessica. Duke. You hit it, Jessica. I don't know, but I remember Wes. We spent most of our time with Wes, and Wes is now a Twitter follower. Fabulous! Wes is? Yeah. I forget his name. He's got like a Wes something. Um, Wes Craven? Yeah. All right, but I am a big fan of the craft distillers. Um, they've got a lot of real oddball bottlings that they do as well. I tried and you, you actually, well, you, you came back with a couple, but yeah. this is actually labeled as organic rye. Right. And I was trying to find the actual definition of organic because I think we all know that, that generally that means no pesticides are used, no growth hormones. Um, but I couldn't find as far as an actual definition in the short time that I looked, what organic means. Um, and I can tell you just from uh, the Wiggle website, they say that this is made uh, from local organic grains that they mill on site. Mm -hmm. They distill it in small batches in traditional copper pot stills to preserve the robust, spicy character of the rye grains. I got to see the stills down there. Um... They've just moved up from um, a smaller barrel size to a little bit bigger barrel size. and Because this is a whiskey blood. Is it too strong or did I kill you? Which is it? You just go on. 
when I talk about World War II or board games or whiskey, I, I tend to get lost in the moment. Those three things actually jazz me. I don't even remember what we're talking about. The whiskey. This is the a rye whiskey. Now, Sweet for some whiskey. reason, when I this night that I sat down with this, I have that it. I had some bourbon notes coming off of the nose on this, but I can tell you right now, I I get straight rye. Mm-hmm. I get spice and I get a dill. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that is interesting. Yeah, I did not list dill, but I mm-hmm. get a dill. I'm mm-hmm. glad you said that because I also list a floral, and I get a. Uh, a little flavor no. that curls in that reminds me of candy corn, but but the dill is in there. It's mm-hmm. almost at the forefront. I'm mm-hmm. glad you said that. Yep, that's and interesting. Like, like the dill, like dill seasoning. If you don't, if you have dill seasoning, go smell it. It's right there. That is 100% accurate. Hmm. You just impressed me, Bruno. <laughs> Blew my mind. <laughs> 46%, a little bit stronger. Uh, most coming in 40, maybe 43 percent. All right, a taste on this like a good mm-hmm. rye, it's like fresh bread. I mean, this feels like bread that, that I just cut with a knife, um, and it came right out of the oven. It is a soft rye type bread with a wonderful warming finish in my mouth, very gentle. And it has a sweet aftertaste that lingers with that rye bread flavor. I found this. I don't know about a pleasant. sweet. I don't know about a sweet aftertaste, mm. but I'm up. I'm, I'm with you on on the rest. It's very rye. The taste is. It seems very clean. Mm-hmm. Um, maybe that's just because I know it's labeled organic, and something <laughs> in my mind is telling me this is clean. Instead rye of like whiskey. a like. A, uh, we yeah. got we got dirty rye. Weed. It is right. Yeah, this is some dirty. This is organic. We used pesticides and everything on this stuff. It's this cray thing cray. would grow in but a crater. Bigger. That's but. where this would <laughs> cray cray. <laughs> it's it's very rye. It's peppery. You get the oak. You're killing me. It's very good. This is a very good rye whiskey. Yeah, um, with a touch of water. I can get a little bit more of the uh, the spice notes out of it, but I got to tell you, ever since you said dill, that uh, that the dill, it's almost it's almost like if you take off the lid on like a dill pickle jar, but you haven't pulled anything out of the water, and I get that dill, and, and you're spot on on that. I mean, it's good enough. I just keep. I'll just. I would just sit here and smell it, and mm-hmm. just keep nosing it, because it smells so good. Um, the taste with water, my notes I've got, it's very rounded, soft in my mouth, finishes with a bit of that rye kick, and again, I got to stay sweet and a finish, and I do get a sweetness back in the, uh, back in the back uh, of my tongue. Very pleasing on my cheeks, um, and then I put, this is a back porch sipping, and then I put time for another, <laughs> so that's right in my notes, right there. So, all right, Wes, thank you for the tour. Uh, We had a good time. I know you only usually do those on Saturdays, and we really appreciated it. I love your place. Uh, I wish I would have been there. I wish you would have been there. So, he's not one of the owners, but he's like the uh, one of the managers. He's like the janitor. Nope, nope. He gave you the janitor, gave you a tour. He's a good-looking janitor. So, uh, yeah, a janitor. Course. The janitor gave you a tour. You thought you was in, like, Flint. Like, and this janitor, you probably like tipped Flint. him, like, 50 bucks. And he's like, yeah. Sorry, Wes, I didn't tip you anything. Sorry. What are we doing? Oh, yeah. Scoring it. My score, should I tell you or should I wait for you to do your little drawn thing that you do? My score on this rye is an 87. 188. Bingo. All right, very delicious. Bart got on me once because I didn't say it. I just turned the iPad turned, to show you what it was. It, showed it. I've got to say it. It's right. an 88. This is a verbal show as well. This is also a talkie. <laughs> All right, see you guys later. Scotch test dummies. Scotch it, you Scotch gods. Cilantro. Dummies. dummies.